Hello followers, welcome everyone. The today's video will be the follow-up of the last one where I discussed in detail the two candles alternating reverses strategy. For those who didn't watch that video, please go to description box below this video. You're gonna find the link and it's very important to watch that video to understand how the strategy works. For those who watched that video, I saw a couple of comments uh, asking why you didn't show us uh, how to trade the three green candles. You know that I don't have any control on the market structures. So at that session, all what I found was three red candles. So that's why I'm uh, making this video in order to show you how to trade with three green candles okay so from the last video you remember with three red candles pattern our six trades our six trades cycle entries pattern was something like this up up down down up up all we're gonna do with three green candles, it's gonna be the reverse order of this, which means down, down, up, up, down, down. So I'm gonna show you an example shortly. Please, for those who watched the last video, there is a correction or a tweak in the money management table. You're gonna find that uh, in the description box of that video. If you need to use that table, uh, you can copy the new updates and uh, remember those figures work for only 90 percent payout or i mean at least 90 percent payout so let's jump uh, to the chart and show you how to trade the three green candles okay now a quick uh, reminder uh, before you start any trading session make sure that your uh, expiry time is set to one minute and the chart Time frame is set also to one minute and remember that uh, this uh, trading strategy requires a minimum of 90 percent payout so make sure to check the payout before you start your trading session okay this is the Aussie New Zealand OTC candle chart as you can see and you notice here that I have two green candles now what I need is simply wait for the third candle to close and I, I need to make sure it closes with the green color in order to have my three green candles you got the point remember here if the current candle closes with red color I have nothing to do here I can't trade so remember always I have to start my six cycle trading only when I have three green candles and I need always to open the first trade at the opening of the candle following the third one. And same thing applies for the three red candles. I'm trying here to go deeply because I saw a lot of confusion in the comments. Do you see the candle? It closes with red color. So I have to look for another opportunity. I can't trade here. I need to go to my pairs list and look for another one okay let me find one we are kind of looking for a golden nugget and you keep doing this over and over during your trading sessions you see here for example i have three red candles i can stop here and wait for the third candle to close if it closes with red color i can start the six trades cycle since i want to show you only three green candles in this video so i'm gonna move on to other charts and find three green candles hopefully i'm gonna find at least one to show you how to trade uh, that here is one two green candles and the third one is about to close 27 seconds left now i'm gonna wait for the third candle to close and it has to close with green color in order to start my six trade cycle now the trades or the option direction pattern will be down down up up down down you got the point about 10 seconds left to the candle closing time my mouse 
has to be over lower option to start the six trades cycle okay two one let's go i just started the first trade then i put 2.11 for the next trade now if i lose this uh, trade i'm gonna enter the second one with lower option or down option let's see hopefully you're becoming more familiar with the strategy i recommend you to watch the previous video again okay the current candle is about to close it looks like it's gonna be a winning trade yes it is a winning trade now let me find another one here is one and you can see here three green candles and the third one is already closed it's kind of late however if the current candle closes with green color you still have the opportunity to start your six trades cycle but if the current candle closes with red color there is no point to start the six trades cycle 10 seconds to the candle closing time hovering my mouse over lower option for the first trade and you can see the fourth candle just closed with red color so we have to move to another chart looking for another three green candles okay let's uh, try this you see we have uh, two green candles and the third one it looks like it's gonna close with green color but we have to wait for the candle closing and it has to close with green color if we want to start our six trades cycle about 20 seconds left to the candle closing time and remember for three green candles the trading's directions or option would be down down up up down down for instance the first trade will be with lower option let's see and remember my mouse has to be over lower option for a better entry timing okay let's go i just entered the first trade then i need to put 2.11 amount for the next trade if i lose this trade so i'm gonna enter another trade with lower option i keep following the trade entries pattern until i get my profit and always keep your eyes on the timer countdown to be ready for trades entry Ten seconds left. Okay, it looks like it's gonna be a losing trade, so I have to enter another trade. Okay, let's go. I just entered the second trade. Now I need to adjust the amount for the third trade, four dollars point forty five cents. Now remember, if I lose this trade, the third one will be with higher option. So remember down down up up down down about 20 seconds left to the candle closing time is likely gonna be winning trade okay finally it's a winning trade so i have to stop trading here then look for another opportunity 
Okay, hopefully you have enjoyed this session. If you have any question, drop them in the comment uh, section. I'm gonna do other examples in upcoming videos. Make sure to subscribe, uh, hit the notification bell so you won't miss the next videos. Until then, see you and thank you for watching.